A total solar eclipse, nicknamed the Great American Eclipse for its long path over North America, was visible in the sky today over parts of Mexico, 15 U.S. states and eastern Canada. About tens of millions of people were treated to stunning views as the moon passes between Earth and the Sun and temporarily blocks the Sun's light. The total eclipse first reached North America over Mexico as throngs gathered along the country's Pacific coast. Just east of Dallas, the hundreds gathered at Mesquite's Front Street station cheered and whistled as the clouds parted in the final minutes before totality. As the sun finally became cloaked, the crowd grew louder. They whipped off their eclipse glasses to soak in the unforgettable view of the sun's corona or spiky outer atmosphere and Venus shining brilliantly off to the right. Hundreds of White House staffers and security personnel watched the eclipse from around the complex, including some staffers catching a glimpse of the partial eclipse from the roof of the executive mansion. Some cheers and boos could be heard when clouds briefly obscured the partial eclipse, but cheers erupted when the sky cleared up enough to see it. President Joe Biden was seen holding eclipse glasses in his hand as he boarded Air Force One in Madison, Wisconsin, where he was traveling Monday, though it was not clear if he took it in. An estimated 44 million people live within the path, but practically everyone else in North America had a chance at catching at least a partial eclipse today, weather permitting.